moments after your, your, your only exhibition of the season. What, do you, what can you take away from it? It was a great day. It's one of those situations where we came out after three days of training, very heavy legs, hot out there. Uh, guys gave a great effort. We were tactically pretty good with our defensive shape. Offensively, we uh, needed a lot more work. Movement off the ball was uh, not as good as we needed to be. And I, I think that showed when we you know, got later into the game and couldn't find some chances to get the equalizer. But uh, you know, we leave this game very pleased with our effort and, and uh, what we were able to accomplish after three sessions. But at the end of the day, we don't like losing, and we got to make sure that uh, we don't get comfortable with that. Over the course of the 90 minutes, uh, was there any player that, or players that you felt performed well after only three days' worth of training? I thought Morgan Saka was doing well today. Uh, obviously, the goal that he scored, uh, he put some good speed in the man of the match, but not only in the 90 minutes that he played, but he came back to the other 45, he put the play through on the breakaway. Um, just really settled the game down for us, found the uh, was able to release pressure with his sequences and passes. So I thought Morgan was a man of the match for sure. Um, the goalkeepers all did very well. Um, and, uh, you know, I think Jose did a great job in the center of the park for the 60 minutes that he played. Uh, and Aaron Thompson came off as a freshman and he did very well for us. So that was, that was always nice to see a freshman come out and feel comfortable out. What strides do you have to make, you know, over the next two weeks prior to your, your season opener on August 31st? Well, you know, uh, ultimately on August 31st, we're getting our legs back. I mean, we're shattered right now, but uh, that will come by our training numbers and whatnot. Uh, the great strides we need to make right now for me is uh, the movement off the ball that I spoke about. And too often we were playing in the Indian to standing instead of passing and moving. And I thought New Mexico was superior with that today. Um, and along with their superiority in that area, we didn't track those runners very well. So they had some breath. So, uh, on both sides of it. One, we've got to get more mobile, and two, we've got to stay with our runners. Um, our back line's got to get in, into a better connection right now. Uh, we took an injury that we were expecting, and so this group's got to start to feel out of themselves and get a better uh, symbiotic relationship with stepping and sliding and being together. Uh, early in the first half, our left back was 10 yards behind the line and left a guy on the side. That's just getting together and working and getting our back line together. So, the things that we are missing out there today are all stuff we can work on. So, we've got a routine with a lot of talent, very dreadful. So, I'm very excited for the performance that's going to come.